Hello, I am Brett from Bearded Man Studios, and today I'll briefly talk about the BRPC attribute. The BRPC attribute would go on top of your method call, and it would be what you would RPC call over the network. So, as an example, I would make a public void test call, and I would like to pass in a parameter of a string and say it's a name. And then to make it work over the network, I simply just add the BRPC attribute on top of the method. And then whenever the network's ready to send a call over, I can just say RPC and pass in the string name of the method and then pass in the parameter of what I want to fill in for the parameters of that method as well in the next uh, com comma. So, as you can see, there's also different methods to go in here. You can pass in the networker for the socket. You can have the receivers and tell it what kind of receivers are going to receive it on the other end, like all, all buffered, all proximity, others, server, owner. And you can kind of mess around and give yourself a, a good way of communicating for different people and different things and how you want to handle that information being sent. So, for the purposes of this demo, I'm just going to say my name is... Tom. And then over here in our method, I'm going to simply just debug log my name is and have the name of what is passed in printed out. So I'm going to save, go right back to my Unity project. I'm going to hit play, hit host, and there you go. My name is Tom and it has called it over the network. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below in the comments or send us an email.